So Professor Liu is going to teach you how to do Chapter Four Classwork Number One. Chapter Four Classwork Number One is actually from your exercise twenty nine B. I will ask you to copy these lines from here. It's okay. First, say Control C, and we're going to learn a a new function called C in that way. That's what we're going to learn too. Okay. So first of all, that's all launched to Visual Studio 2019. Is that right? And file <coughs> and new project. So I'm a new project right now because I have plenty of different things. So I'm going to go make sure I land on C plus plus and empty project. It's okay. Next. And this one I'm going to call this um chapter four. Class work underscore one is that right? Okay, same thing here. So chapter four class work underscore one. I'm going to minimize this. Chapter four class work underscore one is create. All right, for this I don't need property, so I'm going to shrink the property. That's for other class. And as source right here, I'm going to add a new item, and uh, this is the same. But uh, the default name will be source cpp. I want to change to chapter four, class four underscore one. Same name. Okay, sorry. I want to do chapter four, class work underscore one to match your solution files. Okay, add in. Now I'm going to Control V right here. Copy. It. All right. So I I have I/O stream. I have a string. The reason I have string here is because I have get line. Okay. Now this is new. See in get line twenty. Okay. So this means uh oh by the way you have mistake here because we copy paste the. Quotation will change, so you need to retype this. P A U P A U S E. Okay, that's retype. The reason is the quotation will be uh replaced. Come come from word will be uh change. All right. So right now let's take a look. You have two variable, both are string name and goal. So enter your name. You're going to enter a name. We're going to enter our name is more than twenty characters, okay? And when we get in, we will see what your name will look like, okay? Then this program will enter any character, any key, to end this program. So go is any key. So we're going to learn this. So we learn two things from this project. Number one, we want to see how do you control how many characters you can enter. So some, ah,、uh, if your password is only twenty character, this is a way to control your user to enter twenty characters. All right. So, ah,、uh, I'm going to run this program with you right now. I'm going to say build it. <coughs> so build solution. Then I'm going to start start without debugging. So enter your name. Ah,、uh, my name is very long. Ah,、uh, more than more than twenty characters. I I I think that's already more than twenty characters right now. Okay, so I I put my name is very long. Ah,、uh, more than twenty characters. I I didn't count, but it's already more than twenty characters. Okay. So now, hi, my name is very long, more than twenty characters. They take the whole thing. Okay, and press the ah、uh, enter to end this program. Now that you put anything, you you like Y, you like E, X, anything. All right. So enter the program will be ends. Okay. So right here, the C in that with twenty, they did not, ah,、uh, control our, ah,、uh, ah,、uh, it will allow us to go forever. 
So uh, we need to figure out different way. So right now we notice C in that we did not control that and I uh, will figure out different way. But that's your number one question right here. It's okay. So uh, I will stop this program right now and let you work on that. And I will look for the way to control how many characters.